Hey guys, welcome back in to uh, Cliff Empire, that's this game, and uh, we are approaching the drought season. So, solar power is up, groundwater has dried up, and the earth is infertile, which means our orchards will not be working very well. And they expect a large supply of batteries from us, I believe we can make that happen. Let's, uh, let's get this going right here. They want 168 batteries. I can uh, I can do that. Let's do a one-time sale of uh, 50 batteries. We're gonna bump this one right here down to 25. I want to do the same over here. Or anything over 25, I need to keep a few batteries, but I believe I can sell the majority of them and be okay. is doing fine still. I'm going to tell that to stop. So, uh, actually, no, no, no. I do want that. So I want that to do if more than 50. And we are going to tell it to stop selling there, though. That right there is okay. Up here... Oh, that's right. I was like, where am I getting uh, grain at? It's out here in the water. Right. Out there in the water. Okay. Yeah, our fertility has gone down, but we have, we, you know, in our for in my great foresight, I have researched soil, for soil fertility plus 25%, so we actually are doing just fine with that. Everybody's got plenty of sunshine. We are currently researching more solar energy in, uh, output. We're going to get that boosted on up. And then eventually we will also do the wind energy as well. And before we hit num uh, rank 11, I want to get this right here researched because energy capsules is going to be how we generate the majority of our power going forward. Whew, those things are finally almost done i think zeppelins yeah we need one more zeppelin uh zeppelin zeppelin here in centra we'll finally have all of our zeppelins built that's going to be very handy money we're doing great on money at the moment food wise or uh, not really food but just overall materials we're doing great on as well Let's tell this to do another sale of, let's say, 30. We're just going to have to sell all of them. Uh, actually, no, we don't need to. Let's tell it just to sell 20. 25, rather. That's our max. Do one more sale of 25, and that will get us all that we need. Be exactly how much we need. So we're going to go ahead and bump this back up to 50 bump that back up to 50 bump this bump this down to 50 okay all right watch for that battery sale and we're done let's disable that building right there and we'll disable the airport as well once he is finished Yeah, we're short a handful of workers over there, but it's not much. It's uh, it's nothing I really want to worry about. Come on, get that Zeppelin built. Hurry up, because it is chewing through a lot of my stuff. Good deal. All of our Zeppelins are in. How are we doing on tourism money? Eh, 360. You know, it's okay. It's not the best, but it's it could be worse. Well, let's take a look at some more sidewall stuff that we might want to do. Um, we will, at some point, need another uh, vertical salad farm, but we don't need it just yet. But I'm going to go ahead and allocate the space and then just put it to sleep.
I mean, they were real quick to come over there and start putting stuff on there. I couldn't even... I mean, I guess I could have paused the game and done it, but it's fine. We'll put it to sleep, because we don't need it just yet, but we will need it at some point. Uh, I might as well go ahead and get another air purifier in, because I know I'm going to need that. problem is it's where sometimes you can sometimes you can glitch them in in weird places like that but apparently it's not going to uh it's not gonna let me do that this time and kind of sneak it in right there i can't sneak it in right there but i really would rather have this as all all those for the most part That's a good spot for something right there. That would look good. Really wish I could build over here. It won't let you go down with it or anything. It's, it's very annoying, actually. Uh, actually, this right here would be a good place for it. All right, that research is done. Let's get the last part to do another plus 12%. And there's our other metal. We're up to four metals now. Good deal. This right here is going to raise our ecology up just slightly more, up to 84%. So we will have plenty of ecology rating now once we get rid of those nuclear power plants. Thank goodness, because they are killing, killing me here. We have space for 90. We, need, we have 67 people that want to visit. So it's doing all right. Uh, do I want to put in a sanatorium? I could. Very expensive. He's got the most available. So I might do one right there, actually. Yeah. I think I'll do one right here. Let's build a sanatorium right there. We had we had to, we needed some more workers over here, uh, some more workplaces over here anyway. So we'll do another sanatorium. That'll be a little. I mean, it boosts up our medicine a little bit more and our entertainment. We have a ton of medicine available over here. It's very nice. And it uh, increases our because they ha we have 127 people wanting to visit. So that gives us up to 90. This one's got 120. Mm, you know what? We need, what is that? Eight people. This takes nine. 14, okay, that'll work. Let's just go ahead and do it. Let's just go ahead and get another san a sanitarium built over here. People are demanding it, so. Uh, this right here would be a good spot for it. Let's put them right there. Good deal. Now, everybody can support up to 90. That is lovely. Absolutely lovely. Should be getting one more, shouldn't we? That's 15. No, 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 I'm sorry. I was looking at the wrong thing. Um, okay. I can make that. I can make that happen. I'll put one in right there. And we need a few little blocks over here, it looks like. There we go. Little, so we need some more greenery in the town here. There we go. Now we have enough people. Twelve unemployed, that's not bad. And we are right on the money. We are one off. And I am not worrying about one. That is just fine with me. Sell some engines, not fooling with that one. Just not worth it. Uh, I mean, I could do this. I mean, I was thinking about doing this, wasn't I? Adding in a uh, an engine factory over here. 
to make some engines to sell for money. And so I could do that. And we'll tell that to stop buying. And we'll tell this to uh, sell if more than 20. Actually, we'll just sell, sell it to sell if more than 10. And we'll come over here and we will do the same thing. Let's go ahead and get a 3D printing facility set up somewhere. Um, oh, this is going to bother me because it's off by one. I may have to go in and like completely redesign this uh, this town right here because it is it is all off by one. Okay, tell that to stop. Tell this right here to sell if more than 10. All right. And we had some room right here for a couple of corner pieces. Looks like we can put some corner pieces in over here as well. None right there. We won't be able to meet that, but this will let us uh, sell some engines. Start making a little more money. We're still doing fine. Now we're down to four unemployed. That's not bad at all. In terms of food, food is great. Food is great. Food is good. I wouldn't say it's great, but it's not bad. Yeah, we're, we're good. Wait, what was that? Minus 1.3? Oh, it was the batteries. Okay, that's fine. is only producing 33, but we're importing the majority. He's actually is selling some, so we're fine there. He is producing most of our food over here on the side walls with all these vertical crop farms. All right. Let's get a uh, little boost to our research. Uh, let's do it again. Search coming in. All right, let's think about this down here. Because this down here was off by one. Or was it was it this one that was off by one? Yeah, it was. Let's just use this right here as a uh, as a guide for the moment. Did I like place something wrong? No? I didn't. Was causing it to be off. I'm trying to look and see if I placed something incorrectly that would cause it to do that, but I haven't. It's just, it's just off. Actually, it's because oh, uh, I, I understand why now. It's because of this. It's where I placed this thing. I placed it too far over, and it caused every this entire section to be off by one piece. Um, okay, it's actually fixable. So let's spend some time, because we've got plenty of money, we've got plenty of material over here. We're going to start trying to fix this, because, you know, it's got to be right. It has to. I can't handle it if it's not. Space is very important in this game, and if you don't have the right amount of space, you're really going to have a hard time. So we're going to start moving everything over by one piece, by one little part. Uh, the medical college, or you know what? Do I want to do it like that? Yeah, I do actually. Yeah, yeah. Never mind. Sorry, I had to think about that for a second. That is my office building. Ugh. God, yeah, go ahead and destroy it. Okay. It's gonna take 
gonna, it's gonna, this is gonna take just a little while, but it is, it's gotta be done, because I messed up. line it up correctly mess this up too I do like the guidelines being turned on so you can see where everything is at having those guidelines helps a lot okay yeah a little fountain will work okay here's gonna be the part that's gonna suck people are gonna get real mad Got that residential complex. We'll move it over. Come on, come get the uh, the rest of it. Come on, guys, come get the rest of that, please. Please. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. So we are running out of everything now. Let's do a one-time purchase from our other towns of uh, 50. And we've got the extra money here. Let's also do a one-time purchase of 50. We're going to tell it to stop selling. Then we will uh, build up our stock of goodies again and matter so we can keep some stuff around. Let's move the town square over by one. Ugh, I cannot believe that I did that and then I have it off by one. That is so infuriating. Technically, I, just I don't have to be doing all this right now, uh, because at number at honor rank 11, we do get access to the modules, which means most of this is all going to get torn down anyways. So I really, I mean, I really don't need to have to be doing it right at the moment. Let's make the last thing we move as, nah, let's not even do that. I've got it sit I've got it started. So this is a start of moving it around and I will move the rest of it around I think when we go to do the modules and we start comp doing a complete redesign of the cities. I think that might be a better idea. Instead of spending all the time and money on it right now. Cuz I do I will have to tear it all down. And move everything move everything by one free up a lot of room though uh, oh the struggles when you misplace stuff Ugh, sucks okay this right here is now ready more than 75 research complete okay let's slow things down for a second so there is all of our solar energy we are we have a, a very large amount of solar energy now generating 68 uh, solar power from that. That is almost the same amount of energy as one of those big 4x4s four four that was taking up all that room right there. That is absolutely awesome. Uh, let's get the next type of drone going. Alright. Let's 
spend a bunch of money. Let's get that happening. The agrarian drones are very nice. They literally all they do is work is work on picking up stuff from the agricultural sector. That is that is their that is their job. That's all they do. Let's go ahead and do the next part of that. So now we have even more holograms on our cities and even more money coming in from offices and banks because our office and bank income for the last 30 days we have 11,000 in the last 29 days basically 12,000 in the last 30 days let's say it's almost as much as our tax income so we're going to increase that uh, quite a bit more now we'll clear that data let's clear this data clear that one and this one over here doesn't have it because I don't have an office building over here. You now, I'm not going to worry about that at the moment over there. It's not, I mean, the, the financial data is, that is nice, but it's not like crucial to have. So we'll hold off on building another one. Uh, what I could do is I'd like to get some more vertical wind turbines going over here. Looks like I can't build any more there. No? Okay, it's fine. We'll get one right there. Oh, here comes a snowstorm. Strong snow slows down the movement of drones. Fields cannot grow. Okay, so our orchard's going to be having a problem. Windiness makes wind generators work at their limit. It is necessary to spend 30% more energy for heating purposes. Okay. And sunshine has gone down to basically zilch. Okay. It is time to enact a few laws. Let's get that going. Decrease the amount of power needed energy simula stimulation okay and energy stimulation okay let's unpause it sell gadgets oh we're not making gadgets uh pause for a second all right let's switch everything over to gadgets from this over to gadgets. I should have been paying attention that it was a snowstorm because snowstorms require gadgets. Okay. So he's not using as much now. He's still using quite a bit, but we are going to get this other... Let's just go ahead and get another one built. He is going to be the one chewing through that. Let's uh, stop selling batteries. Stop selling batteries. And you also stop selling batteries for right now because we're going to need them. All right, let's unpause. And tell this to sell if more than one resume building operations and that's going to be priority one priority one and priority one these are a major priority for us now Let's see if we can't sell enough gadgets to the orbital station I, I can't guarantee okay so now we have just enough power coming in just barely I think we will be okay. We're just gonna have this this place over here is just gonna have to live off of batteries basically is all it amounts to. Okay, we're gonna have a lot of money stolen it looks like as well. The uh, this one right here, yeah, it drastically decreases your workforce. It is it's really bad. They're okay, they're okay. He's just not exactly great. But I think We'll just have to suffer through that. It'll be all right.
problem is is that I'm it's using the gadgets. I, you can't tell it not to use gadgets. It's really aggravating, actually. You can't tell the people not to consume gadgets. You know what? Just just forget it. This is just going to be one we have to fail. That's one thing that people asked for that he never did was make it to where you could tell it to stop. Like, you know, don't use my gadgets. That is uh, one thing that always aggravated me. So you couldn't do that. So you know what? This is just going to be one we have to fail. That's fine. It is just fine. Can't win them all. Wish we could, but there ain't no way we can get 120 in three days when our people are consuming gadgets. If there is a way to stockpile them, I have never found it. Or, you know, tell the people not to consume. I've never been able to find that, so. So that's a thing. It's, a, it's an aggravating thing, but, yeah, you know what? It is what it is. It's okay. gonna be something I look at look up after I get done recording this episode was was there a way to stockpile things that I have just completely not paid attention to I never noticed that there was these little two little buttons here trade shuttle you can do the trade portal there instead of me having to find it and click on it huh cool they also have this, uh, so this is like your standard 3D camera, and they also have the orthographic view, which is like circa, like, you know, old school, like some old school SimCity views. It does give a really neat view of the city. Um, it does look kind of neat. Let's slow it down, because it's the, the... I don't know if I could play like this, but it does look really cool. So you can get in, like, real close on stuff and look around. It's kind of a neat point of view. Because you're, you're kind of camera locked to certain angles, certain views on it. It's kind of neat. Alright, let's get through the last day of snow, fail this, pay the fine, call it a day, whatever. much extra power. This is our only town that doesn't have like a massive surplus of power. Everybody's doing really good on workforce. Man, I never do this good on workforce. This is like, yeah, doing awesome. Uh, do I want to do any more sidewalks? I kind of really want a monument park somewhere. I love this building. It's an awesome, awesome building. So I can see Monument Park. There we go. I mean, I feel like that'd be a little bit much having two of these giant winged angels right on top of it. 
be it might be a little bit much. Be kind of neat right there. Kind of looking in at the main. <laughs> Uh, let's pause this for a second and I'm gonna use this right here to plan how many I can fit Four, five. okay looks like I can fit five buildings right there okay no not that it's not that okay I can fit five with what is that? Two, t uh, basically three tiles. Okay. So basically, if I just come over one tile, one, two. side so I'm gonna do the angel thing in the middle yeah okay so our angel guy is gonna go in the center right here and we'll take these guys right here out good deal all right let's so unpause it build that angel sculpture right there because this will get the uh, wind turbines coming off the side again just for extra building room but I really want this guy this thing is such a it's such a pretty looking building it takes a lot of materials it's very expensive for you know it's not really you don't even get much you get 0.8 more aesthetics but it is a really awesome awesome looking sculpture I think it's so cool looking so cool looking yeah. Wings just kind of like fold back. I'm probably going to, once I redesign, I may take that out and put like a park in right there. And uh, like move the buildings over here so I have a park right there instead once I redo it all. Or I might do a park on this end. Did that work out like that? Oh, it did, didn't it? Yeah, I think it did. I can't hardly tell. That's off by one. That's okay. I can I can fix it later. Sell some batteries. Well, that's easily done. Uh, one time sale of let's say fifty. Sell some batteries. We're always selling batteries, so. tech going slowly but surely getting up there do I want to move this over that way it's lined up with the edge of that I think I do <laughs> let's do that you know if you're familiar with my uh, my gameplay on Anno you know that I am forever like let's just move this by one it is, it is it's a bad trait of mine that my viewers have always yelled at me about they're like just leave it alone it's fine I'm like no it has to be perfect has to be perfect and now it's lined up so I can do like a park right there and then I can move this over here put that there and then move this to somewhere else later on yeah that'll work I mean it's not like I mean we have plenty of money we make plenty of money yeah we definitely need those agrarian drones to be out here picking up all this kind of stuff that's definitely what they need to be doing. There, that's better. And it looks more centered now. It wasn't looking exactly centered to me, and that was bothering the crap out of me. Maybe it's got something to do with this. That looks a lot more centered now. Such a cool building. Such a cool sculpture. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. 
Yeah, we may not be able to sell all the batteries. It's having a uh, hard time with that at the moment. It's having a hard time making those sales correctly. Okay, eight days, how are we doing? Fines, meh, stolen, meh, United Bank. Yeah, we need to work, think about that United Bank actually too. That might be the next thing we research. We're gonna have the agrarian drones. That's not killing us right now. We, the max count of drones wouldn't be bad though. Whoops, come back here, you. Energy improvements, nothing right there at the moment is crucial. Yeah, let's do the unification thing. Actually, no, 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 because that's gonna take money from Centra. Centra's like, I'm doing really good at Centra right now. We want to lose that. Let's tell this thing to sell at more than 20 for the moment. I need to sell some bulk ones. So we can make our sale in time here. Tell that the same thing. Let's sell more than, sell at more than 10. It's gonna get us up to 150, and it's gonna be this is gonna be cutting it kind of close. I should have lowered the uh, number of batteries being sold, or lowered the number of you know sell if more than. Let's see if we can do it here. It's gonna be cutting it kind of close. Okay, yeah, we got this. Okay, we'll bump this right here back up to sell it more than 50. Oh yeah, there it is. Good deal. We're gonna give that to Factoria. Factoria needs a little extra money. Uh, put this back up to 50. Put this back up to 50. Okay. And he can go sell one more round of it, then I'm gonna turn that off. Research is almost done now. Finally, then we can start our new type of drones with the Agrarian drones, and we will start researching the Unification Project. Because that will start evening out our money all over the place. That's going to be very much needed, I think. Uh, you know, it's just like there's so many things you need to do. Yeah, let's, we need to start with this. That's going to be very important. Um, we've got a while, but it's going to take a while to do all those researches. So, because what those three, those, uh, this line right here does is four, five, and six is the module building start, and you can only go up three levels, and this lets it go up double, like basically double that amount, all the way to six, six levels. So they're technically, I think they're a little bit taller than our current uh, taller skyscrapers and stuff. So. And the city will uh, will start being lost in a canyon of skyscrapers at that point because like one will go right there one's gonna go uh, actually right here and take all of this up it's gonna destroy the look of our I mean I might not I might not remove the, the courthouse I do like the courthouse it is really cool I have to think about that there's another building right here the uh, admit the capital and I am pretty sure that once you build the capital, it it essentially functions as a town hall for every single plot of land. That is my understanding on it. But it was kind of confusing, so I don't quite know if that's how that works. But we probably will end up redesigning our little uh, administrative center here uh, once I'm ready to build the capital. Uh, the only thing different with the capital I don't like is it does remove the justice, so I don't want to do this until we can do modular, module foundations and replace the town hall with some modules. And then we will probably put the, the capital everywhere. pretty sure that's how that works but like like I said don't quote me on that because it was always a little confusing but yeah we'll probably redesign our little government plaza once we can build the capital uh, 
but let's see, let's just go ahead and do a little more expansion. How are we doing over here? 72, 39 out of 40, 19 out of 17. We could actually use a little more education. They have a school. Don't really want to do that. That only gives me 7. This gives me 21 education. education going again. We have plenty of people going again. Okay. Normally I don't do this. This is actually the first time I've ever really built up three whole cities like in their entirety. I normally like to try to do a specialization system where like this is all industry. Agraria is all farms. All of my people are, are in the middle. But this time I decided to uh, forego that and create all my distinct cities. Okay, let's put in another one of those there because we're getting kind of close on that limit. This one is doing just fine. Uh, this one over here is doing okay for the moment as well. He could also, though, use a school to improve his higher education limit. Let's put that over here. Of course, this school requires... Okay, so, 313. If I put in a small one, that's going to give me exactly 15 people. Let's just do that for the, uh, for the temporary at the moment. There we go. That should be everybody that we need to fulfill, and our uh, education has gone up slightly. Good deal. And let's preemptively go ahead and build another bus station. Looks like right here will be a good spot for him. Yeah, that's a good spot for that bus station right there. Now we've got plenty of social transport. I hate when I do that. Okay, fine. Six. I like to keep them all the same. That way they all run out at the same time. So, gotta keep it the same. Gotta keep it the same. 99, 96, 99, 100. He is missing what? Missing like a handful of workers. 15, 16 workers. Bump this right here up, 14. That should give me uh, just enough. So I should have just enough workers now. In terms of food, looks like we're still doing okay. 66 and 42. Still doing all right there. Look how fast that food is moving. That's crazy. An approaching cl uh, cloud front. Now that means all of our solar is going to go out. Ooh, this is this is not a good one. I wonder what they're going to need from us. I don't remember the cloud front one, though, so I can't recall what it is they're going to want from me. 16 and 12, okay. 16 and 8, those are all fine. Oh, what about apples? 20 and 12? Yeah, they're still doing okay. Yeah, because even with low fertility, it's still doing all right over there. Well, let's see what the cloud front one brings us in terms of what we got to deal with. Okay, rainy days have started. Cloudiness makes solar energy inefficient. The level of groundwater 
rises. And the ground is more fertile. Good. Oh, I think they're... Oh, they want food and water. Okay. Food and water. Alright, let's pump that on up. Yeah, sell food to the orbital station. That's an easy one to do. Uh, sell food, one time sale, we'll tell it to do a hundred. Uh, pause for a second. Let's check this. Let's just keep going down that line. Let's turn that on. And I believe it's, is it 10 agrarian drones? It's eight. So eight times three is 24. Let's just crank that on up to like 50. And start pumping out the agrarian drones. And that is going to really help our harvest out. Okay, good deal. Tell that to sell if more than, let's say, uh, 50. And that is selling if more than 50. Okay, good. I think I'm going to go ahead and go put another underwater farm here. So many of these. It's crazy. I mean, I could put them on the sidewall too. Which I think I'm going to do that. Let's, uh, let's take that out. I think I want to do some sidewall, uh, sidewall vertical farm at the moment. Let's just do like one to start. Uh, I don't want to do it right there. Let's do it right there. Actually, no, 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 stop. I don't want to do it there either. I don't want to do it there because I like having that, I like that little corner right there. Let's put him right there. That'll do. That'll give us some extra food coming in over here. We'll do two, just in case. Okay, there. Plenty of food now. Oh yeah, we're great on the food. <laughs> We will definitely make our food quota. I am always way over producing food, but it is for very good reason. Oh, there are our, uh, there they are. See the little agrarian drones? Look at them. Look how cool they, how cute they are. They're so cute. And he's over there getting water. Well, these are even fancier. They don't have the, uh, they don't have like the, yeah, they're actually like repulsor lift. They don't have the little helicopter thingies. There were pulsar lifts. Cliffs, you know, it, you know how I am. It's it's just kind of whatever. Okay, all that's sold. Let's disable this building because we have met our obligation to the orbital station. We're gonna have so much food. It's gonna be crazy. I like this little town right here. I don't know why, but I love the uh, the town hall. This, you know, the Greek building at the end of the walkway. It looks, it just looks neat to me. It's the little things. This game, it's just the little things with this game that make me very happy. But I love the road network over here. It makes it very nice and uniform. It takes up a lot of room. Like that's, you know, that's actually that's technically a lot of room taken up with the roads. But I like the way it looks. It kind of gives them some separation. At least they produce these things pretty fast. Unlike the Zeppelins, which took forever. They took so forever to build. Yeah, we got a little bit of a uh, inefficiency from the weather, from the people. But it's not bad. Slight inefficiency. This is all fine. 
Oh, we are chewing through batteries, though. But we're almost done, is the good thing. But all of their power here is based off of sunshine, so... It's okay. Uh, let's go ahead and just expand this one up to 100. And we're going to expand this one up to 100. We're not going to do it down here, because down here I'm going to... Uh, there's another building at 14 metals that we will be using called the Mall. And the Mall holds like 200, I think like 200, 220 of everything. But we're only going to build it here. We're not going to build it at our other smaller sides. Uh, let's give that money to Factoria. So now we are finally at five. Only like, you know, what, six more to go? Till we find. No. Oh, wait, sorry. Seven. Oh, that's right. I completely forgot. Seven. At seven, we unlock Undercliffs. We unlock this down here. The Undercliffs are going to be awesome because that is going to be how we are going to do a lot of our uh, power generation. Which I'm going to have to sit down and calculate how, how many capsules we need and all this kind of stuff. Because these two cliffs are going to be supplied by capsules. This one is not. It's going to stay supplied by sunshine. And it will be okay. But these two I'm going to switch over off of nuclear power completely. Uh, we will keep a few of the... We'll keep like two uranium towers at each location. But other than that, all the uranium absorbent towers will go away. Research completed. I don't even remember what I did. It was this, right? Okay, lightweight frames. Let's go ahead and get that done. And so, in the next episode, what we'll probably do is once we get this researched, we will go back in and do... Hmm, we'll do this, since we're getting close to uh, seven, uh, seven honor points. We're going to go ahead and do the capsules. That way, our energy capsules will be good to go. And yeah, I think that will be it. Doing pretty good so far. Oh, we have all those. Let's sell. Let's sell some off real quick. Agrarian drones. Okay. Sell some more drones off to the to the colonies or the the other cities, whatever you wanna, whatever you would like to call them. Sell some of those off. Okay, we're making batteries again now that the problem is over. 53, 153, 1. Okay. Good to know. Yeah, he's definitely gonna... Let's just disable that thing. Yeah, let's just disable him. Save some of that charge power. For right now, I think that's going to be the most uh, beneficial thing, is to save some of that charge power. But yeah, I think that's going to be it for this episode, guys. Thanks for joining me. I hope you have enjoyed the episode, and we will see you in the next one. Like and subscribe, and comment down below. I love reading your comments, uh, even though mostly they've just been about Anno 1800, and I know... My channel has mostly been Anno 1800, and I will be getting to Anno 1800 content again here very soon. But this is just a game that I really enjoy, and I just, you know, I just like, I just love this little game right here. It's such a great little time sink attempt sometimes. Well, look, we have something to do on our next, uh, as soon as the next episode starts up, so. I'm going to cut it off here. We'll see you in the next one. Take care, guys.